Aylesbury's top stories in and around Aylesbury on Aylesbury News. Police appeal following a crash in Chidham. Police are appealing for witnesses following a crash in Chedderton. The collision happened at 9.05am on Sunday morning when a silver Vauxhall Corsa travelling on the B488 Alton Road, Chedderton, near Two Station Road, left the carriageway and collided with a telegraph pole. Five people in the car at the time. An 18-year-old male was transported to the John Radcliffe Hospital with serious injuries, he is currently in a serious condition. Two of the occupants were taken to Stoke Mandeville Hospital and treated for minor injuries. They have since been discharged. The other occupants had minor injuries but did not require hospital treatment. Investigating Officer PC Neil Stevenson from the Joint Operations Road Policing Unit based at Milton Keynes said, I am appealing for witnesses to this collision, particularly anyone who may have been travelling on the road and has dash cam footage. I would also ask anyone who saw this vehicle travelling prior to the incident or anyone who saw the collision to please come forward and call Thames Valley Police on 101. Local MP talks about hand and field development. Our local MP has given his views on the new housing development for Owlsbury. The development was given permission by Owlsbury Vale District Council in October and has now been approved by the Secretary of State, Sajed Javid after concerns that it will merge Western Turtle into Owlsbury and worries that the town can't cope with the extra traffic or demand on the hospital due to the extra number of people. Local MP David Littleton, who has spoken with the developers, David said, It was the scale of it that concerned me and the impact of traffic and the risk you would end up with a coalescent of settlements as we would merge with Western Turville. When I have spoken to the developers, they have assured me they will keep a green barrier between Owlsbury and Western Turville, and I think they have to be held to that. I think that we need to make sure they do develop and deliver up front on the link road to relieve traffic pressures and not leave that till the end. Of this process. I think we need to ensure that new schools, appropriate health facilities, perhaps another GP clinic or additional GP facilities on an extending clinic are provided so new residents have services and that's all integrated into Aylesbury as it currently exists. And finally, train causes strange blue UFO across Bucks and Oxfordshire. The mystery of the strange blue glow seen moving across the skies over Buckinghamshire on Wednesday night appeared to have been solved and it seems it was not down to aliens. Despite the wave of rumours on social media, pictures emerged from across the county of an eerie blue light travelling slowly overhead. Lots of theories have been put forward including a UFO, blue alien eye and light pollution. The blue light moved across the skies and was spotted from Chinna and Tame and High Wycombe and Gerrard's Cross as well as in Oxfordshire. However, a video has emerged which appears to show the cause of the blue glow. This CC video posted on Facebook by Shelley Ifill captured a train moving at, a, at speed at 9.15pm on Wednesday with a blue light shining from the roof towards the sky. It's not yet known exactly where the video was shot. Rail companies have been contacted to establish which train was carrying the powerful blue beam and why. 
Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave comments below. Ooh, don't forget to hit that like button and share our videos. Thank you.